We asked journalists in the greenhouse industry to pose questions they'd like to ask Dutch growers. We asked those questions for them on our recent trip to Holland. Hi, I'm Kevin Yannick with Greenhouse Grower Magazine. I have a question about peat moss. Questions have been raised here in the United States and Canada about whether peat moss is considered sustainable. Is that same debate being had in Holland or is it not an issue at all? So um, in the United States in the last couple of years, there's been a concern by some that uh, coconut uh, is maybe a, an appealing alternative to peat moss. People may think that peat moss is a non-renewable resource. Have you faced that sort of challenge? Be sure, yeah. It's like 10 years ago, we had some things, maybe also some, some questions to Brom later, but in fact, it was a big topic and uh, we solved that issue, I guess. Um, our exporters uh, started telling us that they uh, want uh, a certainty that it's not from natural resources which cannot be renewed. Okay. So it used to be a very big issue and mm -hmm. it's not anymore because I think we solved the problem. And we solved the problem because um, the RHP soils, that's a certificate RHP, mm -hmm. um, if the supplier supplies that, we know for sure that it's checked controlled soil from areas which are not are, are, uh, environmental um, yeah, unfriendly Destroyed. destroying oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we don't like to do this so um, yeah since the makers aware I think within over here we found a solution and, uh, in this way so we know it's from certain areas and there's really a lot worldwide so there's really a lot of choice so now they have it from the right areas in our place to be sure that it's a it's renewable resource. And, and on the places where uh, the exporters of the, of the peat moss uh, taking off the peat, they have the obligation to get the natural environment back after they took off the peat moss. So yeah. in the end, there is, an, uh, there is uh, a, a situation where there has been no damage on the ecosystem in those areas. Okay. And that has to be controlled, of course, because if you, if you uh, uh, don't control it, then they, you can get it anywhere from any place, mm -hmm. but uh, internationally and also here in Holland with the uh, peat moss organization that we have over here, uh, it, is, uh, it has tackled the problem which occurred some 10, 15 years ago for the first time in, uh, in England. Okay, so right now it's really not an issue? Uh, here in Holland it's not an issue. Because it's already certified as being yeah. renewable? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so I think that's something that growers in the United States can maybe learn from is that to find the companies that have a certified renewable resource of peat.